What is going on my fellow knights from distant lands, Grey Mamba here and today I'll show you guys the combinations of the Conqueror Knight. The Conqueror possesses a strong defense and is a hard hitter. This guy has a strong shield that he can use to his advantage. Let's take a look at the hero specifics of the Conqueror. At this moment this is the only hero that has a charging attack. You can hold down the R2 button to charge up your heavy attack. Because the Conqueror has a shield he can enter a mode that is called Full block stance. This will block any incoming attacks. This is one of the reasons that this hero has a strong defense. Charging Shield Crush is a charging attack move. This move knocks your opponent down and is unblockable. So that makes it an excellent move to begin a duel. Just like any other charging move, press the square button a few seconds earlier before you actually reach your opponent. If you press it too late, it is possible that your enemy already hit you. Charging Heavy Attack is a hero specific move. This move can be charged like I told earlier in this video. If you hold down the R2 button, the Conqueror will charge his flail for a devastating heavy attack. The Charging Heavy Attack has two charging levels. The longer you charge it, the more damage it will do. As you can see, it also drains a lot of stamina. My advice is, don't charge your heavy attacks when you have low stamina. But if this attack hits, it will do massive damage. Conscript's Attrition is an infinite combo. If used correctly, you can keep hitting your enemy until they die or when you are run out of stamina. The trick to this move is keep switching your stand to keep doing this combo. You can't just keep hitting on the same side, so keep switching sides if you want to keep this combo alive. Final argument is just a regular chain combo that starts off with two light attacks and ends with a heavy one. Just like most other chain combos, you can diverse your stances to execute this combo differently. Reaper's Crush is the last but certainly not the least chain combo. This is a strong chain combo with two heavy attacks. Just like final argument, you can diverse your stances while executing this combo to surprise your opponent. Full Block Stance is one of the hero specific moves. With help of his shield, the Conqueror will defend itself from all incoming attacks, regardless of your opponent's stances. This is the perfect move to use when you are locked in by a group of heroes. Use this to buy yourself some time to wait for your allies. Shield Bash is another opportunity for the Conqueror to use his shield. This attack resembles the Shoulder Bash attack from the Warden Knight. Only this time you are using your shield. This is an excellent move to knock your opponent off balance and setting up one of your chain combos. Shield Bash Ripost starts in full block stance and ends with a unblockable shield bash. Like I mentioned earlier, full block stance can be used to escape from tight situations. If you are locked in by a group of heroes, shield bash one of them to create an opportunity to get some backup or run away. Shield Bash Mix-Up is the third and last of the Bash attacks. This attack starts off with a heavy attack and is ended by a Shield Bash. This attack does some pretty decent damage and can be used to knock your opponent off balance. You can use this attack to create a nice opening for a chain comp. So that's it for this video guys. I hope that this video helped and gives you a decent picture of the Conqueror Knight. If it did, Please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more Verona videos. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section below. Kremamba out.